In this screencast, we'll talk about uh, Python generators in image luminance conversion and uh, binarization. So here's an example of what we do. Uh, this is uh, an RGB um, image of uh, Vsevolod Ivanov's uh, picture, uh, Sichin, which means uh, June. Uh, and uh, so we're going to take uh, an RGB uh, image, convert it to uh, grayscale. Uh, through uh, what is known as uh, relative uh, luminance uh, conversion. So, so this is a gray level uh, image. And then uh, we will binarize uh, the gray level uh, images. And we'll get um, this binary, binary image. So this is the first step and this is the uh, second step. And in the process um, we will uh, learn how to use uh, uh, Python uh, generators. So let's talk about um, illuminance. We will use a relatively known uh, formula uh, and uh, uh, at the end of this screencast uh, there will be a wiki site uh, where you can go and uh, read about uh, luminance, uh, relative luminance conversion. Uh, in uh, uh, greater detail. So we'll take a, uh, an RGB uh, pixel, uh, three values, and uh, convert it to a gray level uh, uh, pixel, uh, one uh, um, a numerical value. So a three tuple uh, into uh, a one tuple. And the formula that we will use uh, is this. Uh, this is from uh, the wiki site on luminance conversion. Um, a point two one two six times uh, R uh, whatever that value uh, of R is uh, in the uh, RGB pixel that we're trying to convert, uh, plus 0.71, uh, 5, uh, 2 times a G, uh, plus where G is the uh, value of the uh, greenness in our RGB pixel, uh, plus uh, 0.0722 times um, a B, uh, where B is the value of uh, uh, the blue uh, color in our RGB pixel. So this is an implementation, uh, a straightforward, uh, take an RGB um, a pixel, a three tuple, uh, and uh, these are the R coefficient, uh, G coefficient, and uh, B coefficient that we just talked about, and we return one number. So let's talk about uh, uh, generator factories. Do we have to use generators uh, to solve this problem? The answer is no, but it is a very elegant uh, solution uh, to the problem of um, uh, image luminance conversion and binarization. So let's suppose that we have um, uh, this RGB uh, image. So we're gonna uh, write a generator factory in Python that'll take uh, RGB images and um, produce uh, Python generators. So let's say um, we call this generator factory uh, and it produces a uh, this G um, object, uh, generator object. So we call next on it and uh, it'll return these um, uh, two tuples. Uh, the first element of which is itself a two tuple and it's an XY coordinate. Um, uh, and the second is a three tuple, which is the RGB values of that pixel. Right, so and uh, we assume that uh, images um, use the PIL uh, coordinate system. X is the column and uh, uh, Y is the row. So on the first call it's 0, 0 in RGB and then on the second call it's going to produce 1, uh, 0 and uh, uh, the RGB uh, three numbers, three numerical values. So here's, um, here's an example. Uh, uh, so here's this graphic um, of an ornament. Uh, its uh, size is 286 uh, by uh, 315 and again it's in pill width is given first and then um, uh, the height. Uh, so uh, this is the genpix factory function that takes a pill image, um, gets its size, uh, the number of columns and the number of rows, uh, or width and height, 
and then it goes um, uh, through the rows and uh, for each row it uh, iterates through the columns and yields these uh, two tuples CR the column value the row value and the RGB at that uh, CR uh, pixel okay. and then we increase the rows and uh, and the columns okay so um, let's open that image the image of the uh, that, that image with the ornament it's a gray level image JPG you can download that image from uh, uh, the link to my blog entry about um, Python generation uh, generators in uh, image binarization and luminance conversion at the end of the screencast um, so here's a generator uh, git git so git next and git next um, so pixel at zero zero then pixel at uh, one zero uh, we can create as many generators to the image as we want and here is a list comprehension that uses a generator to return all of the uh, pixels in uh, the first uh, row row zero that are not white these values uh, are not equal uh, to uh, 255 to 55 to 55 okay now let's talk about converting RGB to uh, gray level Uh, so what we're going to do is um, we're going to take an RGB image uh, again the pill image I'm um, going to use the luminosity the conversion for, uh, formula will be uh, will default to luminosity uh, it's not going to be an in-place uh, transformation we'll create a new uh, gray level image uh, GL image um, uh, get a generator uh, pixel object and um, uh, this is another uh, generator object uh, that will um, uh, go through the values supplied by the genpix uh, and apply uh, the conversion formula to the second uh, value in each uh, tuple returned by genpix and uh, then we will iterate uh, through the uh, lumpix uh, the, the second uh, generator and um, uh, convert uh, the uh, gray level uh, to integer and set the corresponding uh, pixel in the uh, gray level image and return the gray level image uh, at the end uh, so here's an example of uh, this uh, operation we will take this image all right uh, let's uh, free up uh, some resources this is a big image uh, 1200 by 900 or close to it um, let's open it okay convert it to um, gray level RGB to gray level that's the name of the function and um, our conversion um, pixel conversion formula defaults to uh, luminosity and let's say um, it'll take a couple of seconds um, because the image is uh, big and uh, now we're gonna save the converted image okay so this is what the gray level image uh, does and now we can uh, go and uh, binary go, go go ahead and binarize it 
and uh, what we do is uh, we uh, again in the um, I take the gray level image and that's uh, threshold um, the second argument defaults to 70 uh, take uh, get a generator um, uh, object and loop through the generator object and if uh, the pixel value um, uh, the gray level value is less than threshold of 70 then it's set to uh, black otherwise it is set to uh, white Yeah, that's the size of the image. Um, it is it is big. Uh, so uh, that's called binarize. Uh, that is an in place operation. And uh, save um, the binarized image. And um, that's the result.